Good day folks, today I'm going to show you how to connect and use a microphone with the Zune Smooth 4 and iPhones that don't have an audio port. So there are many people who use their smartphone and a gimbal for vlogging, but the thing is they want nice audio. They want to be able to connect an external microphone and that way they get superb audio. Now it's not always a simple task because everybody knows as of iPhone 7, they removed the external audio port the headphone jack which was also the microphone jack and what happens is when you mount your phone in the cradle here the lightning port where you would normally plug a microphone in is covered so in this video I'm going to show you the equipment you need and how you can bypass that so the equipment we're going to be using in this video we are going to be using a Rode Video Micro probably one of my favorite uh, portable microphones good quality not too expensive we're going to be using this clamp and this is how we're going to be connecting the microphone to the gimbal and we're going to be using this little lightning splitter now there's a couple different ways you can connect the microphone to your Smooth 4 and uh, it has a tripod thread at the bottom. You could get one of those plates, uh, but I find that a little impractical. But what I like to use is this mount here. Uh, it's very convenient and it can be used for a lot of different things. So what we're going to do is mount it on the neck of the Smooth 4, just like so. And I like it so the microphone's on that side. It's kind of out of the way there. So as you can see, it's just clipped on like that and then we just tighten it up now the reason why we're attaching that is that gives us a cold shoe there on the side if you can see it and that's where we're going to be placing the microphone so now we're going to take our Rode microphone and uh, it depends how you're going to be using it if you're going to be doing commentary you might want to point it at yourself if you're doing an interview and you want to uh, pick up other people you can uh, face it away from you but for the sake of this video I'm just going to have it pointing towards us you just tighten up that knob there and there you go you can see we have the microphone attached and there's still ample space you can put a dead cat over top of that the one that comes with it if you uh, so want that which is probably a good idea to do if you're going to be filming outside because uh, you will pick up a lot of wind noise so like I said on from the iPhone 7 and up they don't have a audio jack anymore so we can't plug a microphone directly into it but what we can do is plug this little doohickey in now the reason why we're using this is for like a 90 degree connector so uh, we can plug a microphone in there now we're going to mount the phone in like we normally would and that splitter is going to be pressed right up against the motor there and like always you want to balance it the best you can basically this arm is going to be slid all the way out so we've got the phone in there with our splitter we've got the microphone so now it's just a matter of connecting the two now this next step is super important when you purchase the microphone it's going to come with a cable like this this is a trs cable and you'll notice it has two black ends you cannot plug this directly in with an iphone um, even on the older phones or the newer ones what you need is a trs to a trrs cable and that is it here it looks the same it looks identical except you'll notice this one has a gray end and you'll notice that it's different it has an extra kind of like uh, thing in there I don't know what they're called but uh, so that's important you will have to purchase this cable separately I'll include the links down below to all the products that I'm using here just so you can check them out further so the one that came with the microphone where you're gonna set it aside we're gonna take the black end and it's gonna plug into the back of the microphone now we're going to use the little headphone adapter that came with your iPhone. If you got the 7, the 8, or the 10, it has a lightning end on one end and an audio jack at the other. And we are just going to plug in the gray end to that. And now we're going to plug the lightning end into that port there. And there we go. So now we can fire this up. So as you can see there, it's all hooked up. Everything's working smooth. There's no jitter in the phone, having that extra piece attached to the side there. The only difference is now we're gonna have crystal clear audio without all the background noise. This is a directional microphone, so it'll pick up audio pretty well from the direction you're pointing. You'll get rid of all the ambient background noise. Well, folks, that's my video showing you how to add an external microphone to your Zihoon Smooth 4. Well, you have a phone that doesn't have an audio jack. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos and we'll see you in the next one.